Comedy App News, I'm Jay Will. Jamie Foxx fans rejoice. The veteran comedian slash entertainer has revealed official plans to return back to his stand-up comedy roots. On Tuesday morning, while talking to The Howard Stern Show, Jamie confirmed that he is in fact about to go on a comedy tour this summer. The tour will start off in comedy clubs across the country, and according to Fox, he plans to hold nothing back when he returns to the stage. You get them jokes, and it's so it's very tricky. I mean, you came up tricky. in clubs, and people yeah. didn't have cell phones. Do you allow cell phones when you no do a cell club? phones? Because no I'm, I'm I'm going on on my stand up. I'm doing a stand up tour in the summer where I'm just going to all the clubs that I started. In. And you need time to work shit yeah, out. You, you can't work be videotaped. Nah, I don't yeah. And a lot of times, man, they don't understand. Like you know, it, it, you you lose you lose the integrity of the joke. You got to come and get it that night. And, and and I tell them, I say, listen, I'm just gonna be giving out a whole lot of gift baskets because I'm yeah. not gonna hold back on my on my shit. Now this news is huge since it's been over 10 years since we last seen the comedy special from Jamie. His latest one dates back to 2003 with Jamie Foxx Unleashed, Lost, Stolen, and Leaked. If you notice, comedians tend to take their material on the road first before they film a new body of work. So assuming if things go well, we wouldn't be surprised if Jamie also delivers a new comedy special. Given his storytelling ability, we wouldn't expect nothing less than a grade A performance filled with new celebrity stories like his popular takes on OJ Simpson, J-Lo, Terry Crews, Diddy, and Mike Tyson. At one point in his interview with Howard, Jamie retold a beloved story on Prince and even shared his first time he ever met the late icon, which gets us suspecting that we probably will hear more on Prince when Jamie gets back in the comedy clubs. Jamie, who has better parties, you or Prince? When Prince was alive, Prince's death must have hit you pretty hard because you knew me, the guy, me, right? It hit me really hard because not only did I know him, but I I, I I musically worshipped him. A when, genius is genius. I, I musically worshipped him. When I was a kid, I would listen to his music, and my grandmother didn't understand. What's this devil meant? Right. He's singing about pussy. A lot he of song times. Called, he had a song called Pussy Control. He's <laughs> singing about pussy. Is he talking about pussy? I said, yeah, he's <laughs> And Pussy Control is a great yeah, song. Pussy Control. Yeah. And I, I met him. I met him for the first time. December 31st, 1998. It was about to be 1999. Oh. It's at MGM in Las Vegas. And yeah. I look and I said, and I was like, a, I was like a fan. Man, I know that ain't Prince over there, dog. God damn. <laughs> and I ran up, man, you know who you is? Fuck. <laughs> Did you do one of those? Oh, my God. I said, oh, my God. I started kind of crying. But, 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 but that's the problem, too. You, it's hard to have a real conversation like that because you kind of want to be oh, cool. Oh, man, I'm just. You want to be cool. All my cool went out the window. Right. I said, man, I know. I started naming the albums. I'm fucking up the titles. And shit. I said, man, you know, when you wrote the <laughs> shit and the, it was Pussy 19, it was 19 Pussies. 1990 like, oh, Pussies. And, 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 and he was so cool and he knew I was shook. Nah, well, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What Thank is that? You. And I was like, damn, the motherfucker's so cool. And I remember asking for a picture. I was uh -oh. fucked up. I fucked up. Yeah, because he's Jehovah's Witness. He doesn't want you doing that shit. All of the, uh, whatever I did, I just know I fucked up. Did when he tell I said, you no? Ah, yeah. He did. It's That's not. embarrassing. I did that to Paul McCartney because my oh, daughter was with me. Oh, my God. And I said, hey, uh, Paul, can you take a picture? He, he did one of those moves. So I'm like, yeah, yeah, we'll get right back to that. And, and, oh, and, I, and, and Chris Rock was watching me. And he was laughing at me. He goes, you fucking oh, idiot. Oh, I you fucked did. up. And, yeah. and it was the camera. It was the disposable. It was this one. Yeah. I said, hold on. Oh, man, no. me, <laughs> oh, I ain't got none in this one. Let me get them. <laughs> oh, God, I got more in this. And he said, let me get that picture. He says, um, I ain't going to do this. Yeah. You know, you're right, you're right, you, sh you should, you know, what you the should. fuck, but I was like, fuck! Right now, Jamie is set to hit TV with newest game show, Beat Shazam, on Fox. Another Comedy King makes a return. For your latest in comedy news, head over to ComedyHype.com, subscribe. For Comedy Hype News, I'm Jay Will.